lymphatics in glaucoma surgery i start with an outrageous statement the whole body is a lymphatic sponge including the eye and the orbit if there were no lymphatics the retrobulbar hemorrhage shall rot for months if not years the current theories about blood drainage and are ludicrous funny functioning of blab 2001 this is the book it says the aqueous in the filtering blab usually filters through conjunctiva and mixes with the tear fluid or is absorbed by vascular or perivascular conjunctival tissue how is that possible endless absorption is impossible the fluid has to be drained drainage channels are everywhere even in the cornea which i will show see the channels in the cornea see all this network of channels in an old patient lucid interval is a channel the corneal channels drain into the lucid interval you can even pass a 100 micron blunt wire into the lucid interval channel you can pass a 240 micron cannula into the channel if cornea is channel why not the conjunctiva but the mind doesn't know the eyes do not see decades of slip slit lamp use microscope showed no lymphatics pure serendipity i injected lignocaine close to the limbus and i saw a transparent vessel rising a centimeter away ah oh, that is a lymphatic vessel i exclaimed in year 1999 the blinkers were removed from my eyes i saw lymphatics every day some history of channels canal of shlem 1830 asher 1942 collector channels he described 25 and aqueous veins 8 in number norman ashton 1952 his interest was shlem's canal connection to the vessels veins wolf's anatomy shows cartoon lymphatics making loops at the limbus green in color really actually the lymphatics go straight into the limbus as we have photographed so the conjunctival lymphatics are connected to the lucid interval channel which in turn is connected to the cornea here is a 1989 book saying that no true lymphatics exist within the eye American Journal 1999 Torres et al described that 50% of outflow is by uveous scleral flow how that is not known our efforts review of ophthalmology 2002 and 5 journal of cataract and refractive surgery 2003 annals of ophthalmology full article in 2003 presentation at world world glaucoma congress the chairman said never heard of lymphatics now we go to the next paper history continued jenny 2009 described lymphatics in the ciliary body this book edited by hampton roy 2010 has our chapter on lymphatics and the latest book 2011 glaucoma lymphatics are not mentioned observing through the slit lamp you see the uh, corrugated light reflex and you see these transparent lymphatics raw lymphatics if you care to look at them the presence of pigment helps to outline the lymphatics and they appear well and here is uh, a fantastic pictures showing you lymphatics from the limbus to the 
fornix. This patient had lymphatics all around, up and out, down and out. And this is a wonderful picture showing lymphatics crossing in front of the blood vessels. They act like blood drains. Trauma brings blood into the lymphatics. Trauma, another case, another case, and another case. And this one, you look two hours later, the blood has moved away. Limbal lymphatics after microtract filtration. That little hole and you see the dilated lymphatics all around. This was a case of transillary filtration. Pressure on the eyeball pushed fluid directly into the lymphatics. Lymphatics in the operation theatre. Just pull the conjunctiva close to the limbus in any case and you will find transparent lymphatics getting visible. Everywhere you have lymphatics. This case of pediatric cataract we gave incision and found that the blood had gone into the lymphatics. Lymphatics can be outlined by trip and blue injection at the limbus, in the periphery of the cornea and see how the dye travels. Here again this patient had a micro tract filtration after trauma and we inject trip and blue inside the anterior chamber and it goes directly into the conjunctival network of lymphatics. Here is another patient. The dye is being injected and you can see a huge, unbelievable, unbelievably huge network of lymphatics. Ciclera too has lymphatics and uh, this patient had a degenerated conjunctiva near the limbus. We injected trypan blue into the sclera. The scleral channels appeared at other places which ended as knobs because there was no way to, no way to go. And if you look proximally, it has traveled through the sclera into the conjunctival lymphatics. That means the two are connected. Thus we have ciliary, scleral, conjunctival, corneal channels and they are one system. Poor lymphatics, poor results expected. Here we cannot outline the lymphatics, BD lymphatics. Scars destroy lymphatics. Injecting Trip and blue, and you will see that there is no lymphatics in the scars. Saving lymphatics by reducing surgical trauma. That's important. Here is this micro tract filtration done with fugo blade. Pull down the conjunctiva. Uh, use a hundred micron filament to go through the conjunctiva and the limbus into the anterior chamber. Let the conjunctiva fall and place a contact lens on top of it. Then we have transciliary filtration, transconjunctival transciliary filtration. Push down the conjunctiva. This was a 94 year old Parkinson's case held by his grandchildren. Go through conjunctiva, sclera, ciliary body into the posterior chamber. And there is air bubble getting 
Mitomycin does not affect lymphatics. That's what we have found. We deposit 0.01% MMC. You see the intact lymphatics and here on OCT you see the live lymphatic. Here's another case. Avascular bleb and but the OCT shows excellent lymphatics. Schlem's canal has some relation to lucid internal canal as seen on OCT. You see that the two are connected. Increase of intraocular pressure causes uh, edema of the cornea because the fluid travels from the Schlem's canal to lucid interval to corneal stroma. The moment pressure falls, the cornea becomes clear. This is that's one case in which cornea edematous. We are doing trans conjunctival transillary filtration, and the moment the fluid comes out, the cornea starts becoming transparent and before long it is totally transparent. Canal of Schlem got decompressed all around, the corneal fluid got pulled out and that's how it cleared. So there you are, connection between Schlem canal and canal of Singh that is lucid interval canal. Recognition of conjunctival lymphatics shall be an advance in glaucoma surgery. Lymphatics are the flood drains for the aqueous after surgery. Efforts should be made to prevent manual or thermal trauma to them. Our observation lymphatics are not damaged by mitomycin. Glaucoma surgery is far from perfect today. Lymphatics are fundamental, they cannot be ignored. Quoting Victor Hugo. Nothing can stop an idea whose time has come.